Hi, this is Manish Pandey. Welcome back. In this video, we'll learn about file functions, which is a part of Blue Prism native functions. In this, we'll see load binary file function and load text file function. Let me first open this load binary file function. Load binary file function you will get from here file group. This one load binary file is used to load the file and read the contents of a file as a binary data. Let me click on paste and here we you, you need to pass the file name and file name we have a data item. This file name is the path of this one where I have written this related to RPA blueprint. This we are going to read and store as a binary data. Double click on that and remove this file name so that we can replace with this data item. Now we are going to store that as a binary data. Create that one and this has been stored, uh, created as a binary data type, right? Now click OK. We'll take output here in this block. Now right click set next stage, click on step over. And you can see here we are getting as a 627 bytes. Basically this is just reading but if you want to know that's, that really it has extracted the value, extracted the text from this uh, file or not. So you have to write this file somewhere, you have to write this data somewhere. So for that what we have to do, let me refresh that, let me delete this and we need to import one VVO that is, let me click on import, process, click on browse and then from this location you have to import this one that is uh, file management utility file management that you have to import that one and then you can write this data that you have uh, that you have read from here you can write somewhere as a new file so for that you have to take one action stage then you can call the action of any vbu from here we need to select utility file management and go to last here we have write binary data and here we need to take the file name input as a file name where this will write the data which we are getting here. So let me copy this path paste here slash put here new file dot txt and here we need to take that binaries which we are reading from the that function delete this so we are reading and the writing so this example we have taken here let me connect here so right click set next stage now using this load binary file we have read the that file that contains of that file and now using this write binary data we are going to write here and it will create a new file name that is new file.txt and then it will write the same data that we are getting here same data it will write here let me close this and come to this location you can see here just now it has created this file and it has the same data which is available here right because this will write the binary data and this will read the contents of that binary file now we have the next function that is load text file load text file is used to load that file the text file and read the contents of that file double click on that and go to file click on load text file click on paste and we, here we just need to enter that file name which we are going to read now from here we have the file path we'll put here and then we'll write here text file value or output create that so it will be stored here in the text click ok and now right click set next stage and now whatever data whatever contents it will read from that text file it will directly stored in this data item stage and you can see here everything we are getting here right and and then based on this text let me take one example a short example so that i can show you that how we can use these text here let me take one calculation stage, double click on that and let me apply here in str function here, i n str function. And from this text we have this i in str function, 
and this text we are taking from this text file value and what we are going to search we are going to search that blue prism word available in that text or not paste that and we are ready to use that one now store in a instr value that will give us a number so create that now how we are going to use this value you can see let me take here one decision stage and I'm going to check here if uh, INSTR value greater than 0 it means both found that value in that text so if greater than 0 it means we have that value so if, if found so it, it will go uh, to a note which will say that found and connect here connect this connect this and no so go to end and after this here now we are going to read this text file and you can see here we are getting 56 numbers so as per this function it will give you the count from where this this blue prism word starts so it starts from here so it has that value right now it will go to the found right now if I am putting here I want to check that my name is available in this text text or not so what we'll get here click on this we'll get as a zero because this name is not available here so it, it will go to end so by this will we can we can check that so in this video you learned how to use load binary file function how to use load text file function and also how to use in str function you have also learned how to check that the specific string contains in the other string or not i hope this is useful thank you so much